Hi friends, welcome to our tutorials. In today's tutorial, we'll learn how to include Bootstrap content delivery network links into our Angular application. So to include, we need to, to use Bootstrap in our application, we need to include the required styles and the script files in our index.html file in the project top repo. This question has been asked by our reader, Kalavakuri. So I'm here to help you. Like I said, you can ask me your doubts, queries, and I'll be happy to help you. So this is in response to the question that was asked that, how can we use CDN, Bootstrap CDN links in our application? So let's get started with practical. So I'm going to fire up the application and you can see here, I've just created our previous project and I'm just doing ng serve. This will get our application up and running and I'm not using any bootstrap. That's what I'm going to show first. And then I'm going to show you how we can use bootstrap. So, so this is how the application looks without any bootstrap. So if you see here, this is a button which does not have bootstrap applied yet. So we are going to learn how to apply that now. So the application is compiled successfully. So let's navigate to the bootstrap CDN page. And you can see here, these are the bootstrap CDN required links. So let's copy the bootstrap CSS first and navigate to our index.html in the project. This is the main file where you will apply all the styling that is coming from our CDN. So navigate to index.html, include that link here, which is for bootstrap CSS. And similarly, if you want to use other options of Bootstrap, include the scripts as well. So just include the scripts. That's all you, we need to do to include Bootstrap into our Angular application using Bootstrap CDN. Now let's go to our application and we should see that the styles are applied. You can see here now the font has changed. The links have changed. The button is now Bootstrap button to show you that it's really working as expected. And I'm going to make it BTN secondary. So now it's gray color. Let's use another class info. So there we are. So now our application is using Bootstrap CDN to style. So you can go ahead and use all the Bootstrap components or elements in our application. This was how to include Bootstrap CDN. Uh, my request is please subscribe to my channel to keep supporting me. Also, if you have any questions, any doubts, feel free to ask me in comments. I'll be happy to provide you the solutions. Thank you so much for joining. See you in the next episode.